All right, so welcome to this stupid shit where we're building fucking concrete. Um, so we got a little bit more uh, sand last time. We're cooking up four stacks of glass as we speak. Um, and I'm just kind of spending the rest of my time just getting the concrete. And then we'll eventually just convert this into um, concrete out of the powder. So we need a half stack of gray, which is not a huge concern for me. So let's take, um, we need two white and two ink. And um, I do I do not, ha I already know I don't have enough bone meal, but if I need more bone meal, I'll probably just uh, use the sugar cane I have. So I'm not terribly concerned about it. Um, we need to make four gray dye. And there we go. And we will go ahead and uh, get, again, we will get our uh, 16 is a little bit more annoying. When you don't have a clean stack. Okay, there we go. And 16. There. And we will use this to create our gray concrete powder. Amazing. Fantastic. I all, I love it. Thank you. Uh, we also have black concrete. We need four ink. One, two, three, four. We need another 16. Well, why don't I do this? Why am I a dumbass? Hello? Okay. Um, we'll do that. And then we'll uh, get our black dye, and then we'll get our black concrete powder. Easy. Then we need um, a whole stack of light gray concrete. So actually, let's um, put this shit away. No, thank you. All right, we'll get this, and we'll get this, and we will do that, that, that. And we need to make another uh, nine. So we need six. So I need more bone meal for this. So let's put this up here. We'll get. Um, some of our sugar cane because it's going to be a while before we need this. Uh, um, and I think it, it seems to have a pretty reasonable um, rate of bone mealing. So um, do that. There we go. So that would be six. And we need one, two, three. There we go. And I think this is all we need. The rest should be colored. Um, that sounded really racist from like the <laughs> like the 1950s. <laughs> okay, we'll make our light gray concrete powder. We've got a stack of it. And this will just go in with the other light gray dye, which we might use one day on something. And um, what else? What else is there? We need uh, we need cyan. So we need two flowers, which I saw I had in here somewhere. Yes, I have this, and I just need two of you. Let's make our blue dye, and then let's make our cyan dye. And then we'll take, of course, our... Um, well, let's do this actually this is a good idea and then we will spread this out here like so and then we will also take our four green dye how about that all right so we'll make our cyan concrete powder and our green concrete powder in one fell swoop there we go and uh are you the same one uh you are and i again still don't have emeralds because there's no uh, i haven't done much exploring in this world so uh yeah let's go ahead and uh convert this while our glass cooks away and then we should have enough material how about how exciting is that now of course this will be the last episode in this recording session um uh, but we are only four minutes in and i think that i should have enough time to convert this all into uh concrete so that's a really exciting uh, place that we've gotten to in our lives. Let's um, kill you, because uh, again, ink is uh, ink is the hardest resource to get. So you know, I can always make more bone meal. It's just a matter of time. Ink is a matter of getting good spawns on your squids. So that ink is the real fucking problem here. So let's go ahead and uh, convert this all into official actual concrete. No, I'm not building a concrete maker. You fucking monsters. I'm not there in my life yet. So we'll go ahead and keep doing this. And, uh, yeah, the greenhouse is a little bulky, but honestly, it doesn't even look that bad. I'm not even that, that upset with it. I'm not going to lie. So, you know, I can live with it for sure. So we're going to – actually, I should probably be standing here. I, I, I have to figure out where to stand every single time I make concrete. I keep forgetting. So we'll do this. We've only – it's not even that much because I usually do a stack when I use this technique. So this is not bad. Um, we'll also keep an eye out for Enderman here because now I'm not afraid of the beasties in the night. Um, so that's not going to be a problem for us. And there we go. Um, so that is right there. That is our white. Let's get our gray. Let's pillar up. And, uh, yeah, it's, uh, I don't know. 
I'm, I'm kind of hoping there's Enderman, but on the other token, if I'm not walking around, I'm not going to get any new mob spawns, so I'm not really that uh, optimistic about it, but, you know, there's always a chance, isn't there? There's always a chance. Let's uh, get this. Yeah, let's do that. So, uh, we have a couple minutes to kill. What else is there to talk about? I don't know. This has turned out pretty well for us the last two times. Maybe I can get a, a, a winning third out of here. Um, what else is going on in, in, in the in the universe as we know it? Um, there's, uh, I don't know. I mean, the only things I know about are, like, things happening in foreign countries that no one probably cares about because America is kind of a not interested in other countries' country. <laughs> but... Uh, I don't know. Is I it's I, I'm thinking, trying to think of like movies and stuff. But the only movie that anyone has been talking about forever has been the Joker movie, and that's kind of already been addressed. But um, oh, there's a chicken. You know what chickens remind me of? I uh, have seen chickens multiple times. That's not very exciting. But um, in uh, Hawaii, we went to Hawaii. There's wild chickens all over the goddamn place and it's fantastic i love wild chickens they just like roam around and they cluck like at badasses dude um i don't really know what they eat i think i mean i know that they eat like grubs and seeds and stuff I, I bet there's probably a lot of grubs out there though i don't know but it's like all volcanic ash and stuff but i don't i don't know do you think they have worms out there i don't know i'm not a hawaiian i don't fucking know how this shit works I don't know. Oh, this is a full stack, though. This is going to take a long time. All I know is that I just want to finish all this concrete before this episode's over. And then the next time I start, when I start recording session number five, uh, we're going to be in hog heaven because um, we're going to be in a, we're going to be, we're going to be swimming in resources and we can finally do what we've always wanted to do, which is build our greenhouses. That's really all I want. That's all I want. I just... I started building the greenhouses. I felt so fulfilled. I'm like, it's been so much work. And you know, that's the that's the strength of Minecraft, isn't it? You know, Minecraft has the strength of like, hey, you worked really goddamn hard to get all the resources for this building. Isn't that nice? Oh, no. There we go. It's like, yeah, Minecraft, that is nice. And then you finally start building, and it's like, oh, but you didn't work hard enough. Lame-ass fucking child. Like, like, I'm being, like, scolded by a parent for my bad work ethic or something. Like, get the fuck out of here. I worked hard enough for these resources. It's been like 10 years that I've been gathering materials for this stupid project. I want to build it. But Minecraft's like, no, no, no. You didn't try hard enough. But I think this place will look pretty cool once they're all built. Um, I haven't even like lay like lowered the land for the last two. But I'm kind of taking this one building at a time at this point. I don't know. Um, I, I, I think that it'll look pretty cool once they're all done. I just need to do the landscaping, get them set in the environment. But... Um, that's kind of a separate issue. Um, we do, in the near future, need to... Uh, my pickaxe is going to break. That's okay. Um, we do need to start a mine, eventually. Uh, that's probably one of the... Among the next things I'll do. I'm kind of talking shop for whatever we're going to do after we eventually reach um, the the vaunted pinnacle of human existence that is finishing my greenhouses. Um, I'm kind of hoping that... I can, uh, this wandering tree. No, 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 I don't want to sleep. Okay. Although that's good because we set our spawn, so, you know, that is what it is. Um, I, I'm kind of just imagining a world after that, and I'm thinking one of the first things I want to do is start a mine, so, you know, if, if we ever do reach a point in this series where I end up actually finishing the greenhouses against all, um, against all odds, really, uh, then that's going to be pretty cool for us, I think. I think this will actually be a pretty cool place. I'm not going to lie. Um, the only problem is that this is uh, centrally on a, on two. I might need to actually expand this and waste a lot of glass. That, I, I'm, I'm just thinking. Um, I don't necessarily like... I don't... Because the problem is that I'm going to have to have two um, concrete bars here. I got distracted because I'm supposed to be making concrete. Actually, I'm going to go make concrete. Cause I, I could talk things later, but I want to have all the materials made. I don't want to be doing this when I come to play next time. Next time I play, I want to fucking build. I don't want anything to get in the way. That's what I want. So I'm going to start. I'm going to have to kill the spider. Because he's going to be able to climb my tower and just hit me with a 
hit his foot with his best shot. Did you just jump underwater? Is that even legal? What the fuck? Anyways, um, so we're gonna, oh, ink. Die, 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 die. Okay, there we go. Um, so how much time do we have? We have five minutes, perfect. Five, five minutes is ideal because that gives me enough time to do this. And then if we still have time after making concrete, I'll talk more about maybe expanding the greenhouses out by one. Because um, that's uh, valuable, you know? It's valuable. There's another squid down there I'm going to have to maim and rip his legs off and eat. Um, but that's... I can't eat him, can I? I wish you could eat squid, actually. That would be cool. Because you can in real life. It's like, what What gives, Minecraft? What the fuck? I'm not allowed to eat squid. I can eat cows. I know Minecraft is like trying to be like... An, like a, it's sort of like... S they understand like their responsibility because they have a lot of children who play this game so it's like you know we have to you know respect the environment and that's why you don't need to, like get any good drops from turtles because like probably don't want to say like hey it's good to kill turtles but like you can eat squid in real life like people manufacture squid so like i'm not gonna buy that excuse when it comes to squid you're gonna really rain on my parade aren't you whatever i don't even care Let's see if i care i don't care so yeah, that, that's a, that's a bad excuse that Minecraft is not allowed to use anymore. At least for squid. I understand it for like, I don't know, um, maybe if they ever had ostriches or like parrots or things like that. Like I understand not wanting to incentivize the killing of those, but don't no go away. Oh, he's being chased. Good. <gasps> oh shit. Shit, amigos. Oh, shit, amigos. Hang on. This is DEFCON 5. Red alert. We have Enderman sighting. I'm going to pull this one. Oh, is there? I thought there were two. Oh, he's over there. Okay. Go over here, and I'm just going to give him a good whack. 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 You see, I've devised a, a wide array of Enderman killing tactics. The shield... The shield block followed by two sword strikes, the stand in water, and the, uh, put a, put a two, or put a block right above your head so he can't reach you. Like, these are all valid tactics, and they're wonderful, and I'm very glad I get to show off all of my three tactics in their full glory. And you know, this one's way easier. I love the water one. It's just usually you don't have a giant pool of water standing around for you to use. No ender pearls. That is a shame. But you know, I'm not even that upset about it because ender pearls are, uh, you know, uh, they're they're a little more rare. Uh, you know, I'm I'm not expecting. It. And again, because we began the enderman hunt so early, like when I kill an enderman when I'm doing the enderman hunt and I don't get an ender pearl, I'm like, God damn it, this fucking game hates me because it's like I don't want to spend all night just looking for enderman. But if I do it here, it's, like, much more understandable because it's like, well, you know, I'm, I'm going to be doing this for, like, ten years, so, like, who really cares? So, um, when we already have three ender pearls, and I, I probably want, like, 14 to be comfortable. Like, honestly, it's not... Oh, no. Well, I have to pillar faster than he climbs. Get away from me! Get away from me, you freak! I don't want you here! Is he still following me? Oh, he gave up. <laughs> Are you still aggro? It's daytime. Thank you, buddy. So, um, yeah, so, uh, I only need, like, 14 ender pearls, and the fact that we already have three and we haven't even started a mine shaft is probably a good sign for us, so, um, that's, I'm not terribly worried about it. Um, are you a different wandering trader? What are the odds of that? What the fuck? Isn't there, like, a 1 in 200 chance? Or, no, it's, like, a 1 in 50 chance that's done every, like, two... Is it, like, 20,000 game takes or something? What is the rule for your... Sp oh, you're the same one, though. You're the same one. I, I forget what the rules are. I want to look back into the Wandering Trader uh, spawning policies. Because it's it's something ridiculous. It's, like, a 1 in 50 chance. And it only attempts it once every, like, 20,000 game takes. Which I think is, like... I don't know, like, 30 minutes or something. Um, I don't remember. I, I should... I really enjoy knowing, like, everything there is to know about Minecraft. So I kind of want to... Uh, look back into that so i can be i can continue to hold my title as like the resident expert of minecraft among my like 
friends that play Minecraft. <laughs> so otherwise, if I, I don't want to slip, dude. Like, what if one of them asks me, like, hey, what's the specific spawning rules for the wandering trader? What am I? I'm going to look like an idiot if I don't tell them the exact um, probabilities and the time frame in which the probabilities are, are uh, executed. You know, I'm going to I'm going to say here I'm going to have egg on my face. I'm going to be embarrassed. It's a bad time, right? So I have to look into this so that everyone knows that I'm God and that um, my self-esteem is definitely not connected to how much I know about video games. I don't know why you would insinuate that. It's a little bit rude if I do say so myself. Um, I'm going to connect, collect the rest of this glass. And with that, folks, hang on. I know the episode's technically over because we don't have enough time. But can we just say, folks, can we just say, I'm very excited to announce we now have enough glass for all of our needs, plus another stack in case anything goes wrong. So this is absolutely thrilling to see. You love to see. Actually, this needs to go here because I need a full stack there. Uh, not sand. You go here. That's awesome. We have our we have our materials now. Oh my god! We can actually start building when uh when we get back in the next recording session. So that's super exciting. That's super exciting for us, folks. I love to see it. Um, we also have bones. Why didn't I think to make that into bone meal? Whatever. Who cares? Um, this episode's over. Um, when we come back next time, ideally I will start building. But honestly, I have no fucking idea. I'm probably going to need to go mining, actually. I'm probably going to go caving. Um, so I would expect next time I'm going to go caving. And then um, from there, uh, yeah, we're going to build... Mm -hmm.